Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those who are new, welcome. My name is Monica. And for those who are not new, welcome back. It's great to see you here again. And for today's video, I am going to be highlighting some of the new releases that are coming out in May. And I'm going to be talking about my May TBR. <music> So when I'm filming this towards the end of April, this is all the information that I have that is correct. So let's dive into the new releases. Releasing on May 1st is Illicit King. This is book one in the Mafia Wars Ireland series, and this is written by Maggie Cole. And it does have an audiobook, and the narrators are going to be Ren Ross and Mia Madison. Okay, So there's a lot of books releasing on May, May 2nd. Um, Painted Scars. This is book one in the Perfectly Imperfect series by Neva Elta Jazz. I can never say it correctly. This is an audiobook only release because the paperback and the ebook are already out. And Gregory Salinas and Allison Waller are going to be the narrators. Also releasing on May 2nd is Echoes of You. This is book two in the Lost and Found series by Katherine Cowles. And yes, there is an audiobook, and the narrators are going to be Jason Clark and Aaron Mallon. Also releasing on May 2nd is Fourth Wing. This is book one in the Empyrean series. This is by Rebecca Yaros, and there is going to be an audiobook. The narrators are going to be Rebecca Soler and Teddy Hamilton. Um, again, on May 2nd is Beyond the Thistles. This is book one in the Highland series by Samantha Young. And there will not be an audiobook released with this. And the last and the last book being released on May 2nd is Meet Me at the Lake by Carly Fortune. And there will be an audiobook that is going to be released. And the narrators are going to be uh, AJ Bridal and Carly Fortune. Releasing on May 4th is Runaway Love. This is book one in the Cherry Tree Harbor series by Melanie Harlow, and there is not going to be an audiobook released at that time as of what we know right now. Releasing on May 5th is Hacker in Love by Lauren Rowe, and there will be a audiobook, and the narrators are going to be John Lane and Lily Reynolds. Releasing on May 9th is Grimm and Barrett. This is book six in the Stay of Spell series by Juliet Cross, and there is not going to be an audiobook that's releasing with the book. Releasing on May 11th is Charlie Love and Clichés by Ella Mays. Um, there is an audiobook, but it says UK. There's no information for narrators or anything, so I'm not sure if it's going to be released in just the UK or is it going to be um, released in the United States. So I don't know. Um, I'm sure we'll get more information when it comes closer to release date. So the next release on May 16th is going to be audiobook only as the paperback and the ebook is out. And this is for Offside and this is book one in the Rules of the Game series by Avery Keelan. And the narrators are going to be Stella Bloom and Gabriel Spires. Also being released on May 16th is The True Love Experiment by Christina Lauren. And this is going to also have an audiobook and the narrators are going to be Jonathan Cole and Cindy Kay. Releasing on May 17th is Chapel Bend. Um, this is book three in the Huckleberry Bay series. Um, there is no audiobook that is mentioned, but she generally announced them very close to the release date. So being released on May 18th is Dangerous Innocence. This is book one in the Five Leaf Clover series by Cora Riley. She is now going to be doing an Irish Mafia series, and I'm really excited about this. There is not going to be an audiobook for this. She usually waits a couple months before she uh, releases any audiobooks. So, but I'm going to read this with, even without an audiobook. So also being released on May 18th is Under the Stars. This is book two in the Cottonwood Cove series by Laura Pavlov. And there is no news of an audiobook. So it's probably just going to be print and ebook, but there's no news of an audiobook. Releasing on May 23rd is The Duchess Takes a Husband. This is book four in the Gilded Age Heiresses series by Harper St. George. Um, and no news for an audiobook, but I'm sure she will release one in or around the time that the paperback is released. Releasing on May 25th is Liars Like Us. This is book one in the Morally Gray series by J.T. Geisinger. And there's no news for an audiobook. And the last book that I'm going to highlight that's going to be released in May 
and it's going to be released on May 25th is Identity. This is by Nora Roberts and there is an audiobook and the narrator it will be January Laveau and this is definitely going to be a sus romantic suspense, probably more suspense thriller than romance because that's where Nora Roberts is heading towards as of right now. So so obviously I can't read all 18 books that are coming out in May. I mean, I could, but that would be pushing myself and I don't want to do that because I don't want to get, in, get into a reading slump. So I put together a small TBR that consists of a couple books that are on TBRs that I put together in January at the beginning of the year, as well as one book from a book club that I always participate in. Um, on booktube. Now here's the thing. Um, the only reason why I have this book for the historical Hellions is because they had already announced it and it's going to be Devil's Bride um, by Stephanie Lawrence and I am excited for this one. This is going to be a reread for me. I love this book. I read it back in 2021 in July. So I'm excited for that one. The other uh, book clubs that I do participate in, they haven't announced anything yet when I'm putting this together. So I'll just add those to my TBR when they are announced. And from my 12 recommendations from 12 friends TBR, I'm going to be reading Out of Love by Jewel E. Ann. This has been recommended to me by Cheyenne from That Tall Book Girl. On my TBR for 23 books I want to read in 2023 is Painted Scars by Neva. Um, Here's her name. <laughs> I'm not going to try and pronounce her name. I'm horrible with names. So that book, I'm actually excited that they have an audiobook coming out for that. I was going to read it um, on ebook, but now that an audiobook's coming out, I'm just going to go ahead and wait for the audiobook to come out in May. So that's why it's on there. So for the new releases that are coming out in May, I am really excited for Grim and Barrett by Julia Cross. This is the sixth and final book in her Stay of Spell series. I love this series. This series is fantastic. And I am so excited for Clara and Henry's romance. I'm just dying for it. I really, really want that book now. <laughs> Same with Fourth Wing by Rebecca Yaros. Rebecca Yaros is one of my favorite authors. She's a fantastic human being and a fantastic writer. This is her... Um, well, it's not her first fantasy, but it's the first fantasy that's published. So yeah, we're, I'm excited for this one. I'm also excited for the Catherine Cowles book, um, Echoes of You. It's coming out the same day as Fourth Wing. So I'm kind of like, I don't know which one I want to read first. That kind of puts me in a quandary, but hey, we shall see. Also, I can't forget about the Queen Nora Roberts. Identity is coming out and I love Nora Roberts. She's fantastic. I love her, um, romantic suspenses. Um, this is probably going to be more suspense than romance as she's been going that way lately, but I'm still excited for that. Also, um, Chapel Bend by Kristen Proby. I have been reading this series since it started and I really, I'm enjoying it. It's small town. It's low angst. It's a, it's just a good time type of a book. The last book I'm really excited for is Dangerous Innocence by Cora Riley. I'm so, so, so excited for this book. This is her first foray into the Irish Mafia, and I'm really, really, I'm stoked. I cannot wait to get that book in my hand. So those are the 18 books that are coming out, as well as the nine books that I'm definitely going to be reading in the month of May. Is there a book that you're interested in? Let me know down below, and uh, let me know if you are excited for Cora Riley's new book, too, as well as Rebecca Yaros's book. Um... And if you don't want to leave me that, leave me a uh, yellow heart emoji since we're going into May. And as always, happy reading and have a great day. Bye. <music>